Have you ever tried to make your own brushes in Procreate and then got overwhelmed with all the different settings? I know just how you feel. I used Procreate for a long time before I actually started creating my own brushes, just because there were too many options that I didn't want to deal with. And as someone who has crossed that bridge, let me tell you, it's totally worth it and slightly addictive too. It's not only fun, but it's also a great way to streamline your process while taking your artwork to the next level. Creating your own brushes will allow you to save time by not having to redraw your most used elements over and over again. It can help develop your style and make your artwork more recognizable. In this class, you'll learn all about the Brush Studio. I broke down the settings into bite-sized lessons that go straight to the point. You'll learn these settings hands-on by making a variety of brushes, not just boring lectures. We'll start simple and build up with each lesson, so I promise you it's not as scary as it seems. And once you understand these settings, you'll be able to create any brush you like. The sky's the limit. By the end of this course, you'll have a custom set filled with a unique variety of brushes to share with your friends, create giveaway for social media followers, or even sell online for some extra income. Lessons include different settings in the brush studio, how to create a new brush set, editing existing brushes, creating unique brushes from scratch, and some Procreate tips and tricks. Some of the brushes we'll create in this course include chain brushes, stamp, color changing, pattern and texture, dual brushes, and more. Our project will be to create a custom brush set. It can include a mix with different types of brushes or variations on the same type. And if you want to get really creative, you can share an illustration using the brushes you made. So make sure to share your project in the class gallery. Knowing your way around Procreate is recommended, but all levels are welcome. While having some Procreate knowledge can be helpful, the brush studio is kind of its own thing. So even more experienced students who haven't really explored the brush studio in depth can still benefit from these lessons. And since this is something that I wish I knew when I got started, beginners are very welcome too. I've even included a lesson especially for my beginner students with a quick overview of the brush tools. And I've tried my best to keep my explanations as straightforward as possible. But if you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the class discussion and I'll get right back to you. But wait, there's more. I've included some nice freebies for my students. Go to the class resources to download a free butterfly stamp brush set. You can also download it from my website. As an added bonus, you'll gain access to a private folder with a growing resources library. So make sure to check out this link in the class description. Are you ready to conquer your fear of the brush studio and learn all about creating new brushes? Let's get started.